singer Jimmy Buffett has a new album out. Buffett has made a career out of portraying the laid-back lifestyle of Key West in his music. But contrary to the lyrics of one of his most popular songs, he is far from wasting away in the relaxed isolation of his island home. CNN Sandy Kenyon has more. The most famous resident of Margaritaville took to the road last summer, recording a live album along the way. I must declare my heart is there, though I have been from Maine to Mexico. I really owe this to the fans because with my sort of uncategorizable presence, I, I don't fit too many uh, holes where people can put me in, and the fans have been the ones that supported me. Buffett manages to prosper even without a hit single or much radio airplay. I write story songs and I write songs about events that have happened and events that I've witnessed and uh, I think through it all people still have a basis for that. It's part of human nature to want to hear a good tale. These days most of Buffett's tales come from the past. I lived a pretty wild and fast 10 or 15 years there, you know. And there were times of a, in my worst behavior, I thought, God, what am I doing? Am I going to kill myself here? I think I was one of the fortunate people that came through the wild 60s and 70s, but now what I've got is an incredible amount of material for stories. In his college days, Buffett was a journalism major who worked his way through school by performing. A job with the music industry trade paper Billboard led him to Nashville. By taking another road, he became unique. His sound, a blend of tropical spirits and a laid-back attitude with a healthy dash of humor thrown in. I will always perform certain songs because the public wants to hear them. I, I'm not one that says, well, I'm tired of that. I'm a performer, and I'm paid and paid well to perform. And if people want to hear the songs, then they get to hear them. But these days, the party lasts only as long as the concert. Sandy Kenyon, CNN Entertainment News, Hollywood. Uh, the troops in the Gulf cannot waste away in Margaritaville, and it looks like they're not going to see Brooke Shields either. The actress was planning to head over with...